For 10 years, Penny Taylor ran up and down the court as a player with the Phoenix Mercury. But this season, she moved to the sidelines, seeing the game through a different lens as Director of Player Development and Performance and coaching alongside her good friend, Sandy Brondello. Coaching's a different story. There's all the scouting and all the, um, you know, the information you have to gather about the other teams and the other players. And uh, as a player, sometimes you just sort of know that stuff um, more specific to your role. Um, but knowing it on, on a broader level is, is quite um, challenging, but I'm enjoying it. And obviously I've got three great coaches to learn from. The switch from player to coach is often difficult, but with the bond that Taylor and Brondello have built over the years, it has made the transition that much easier. Because she's been in my system, she kind of knows what's, what I want and what I expect, so it's easy for her to translate to the players. Taylor and Brondello first met when both were members of the Australian national team. Brondello was a veteran player when an 18-year-old Taylor made her debut. As an older player on the team, I kind of took her under a wing a little bit, and we just developed a friendship from there. Sandy's someone I watched growing up, first of all. She was also a mentor to me. She helped me a lot in the national team and uh, was able to like help me feel comfortable and um, just was a friend. Brondello sees a bright future for Taylor as a leader on the sideline. She's going to be a hell of a coach and uh, she's already showing, seeing things on the court and it's not that she doesn't know everything already but you know when you step onto the other side it's more about you're not taking care of yourself anymore, you're looking at the whole team. Brondello said the main focus for Taylor right now is to work with players one-on-one -on -one to help them improve upon their weaknesses. In Phoenix, Sarah Haddis, Cronkite News.